All right, so now that we covered the big four, I want to move on to some of the other items that I consider essential, but not maybe as important as the big four. For example, a sweater. Um, a lot of people don't want to bring sweaters on a backpacking trip. They only want to bring lightweight uh, fleeces. You could just bring any wool sweater. It'll be really warm. It'll be, and it's not that much heavier. So when people think that uh, a sleep si or a clothing system on a backpacking trip has to be vastly different than your regular clothes, I don't necessarily agree with that. And it could save you a lot of money by not buying backpacking specific clothing. Uh, so this is just a sweater. This is the wool socks I posted on the Google Sheet underneath this video. And there's just REI wool socks. Uh, the, the first time I went out backpacking, I was wearing cotton gym socks. Th that did, don't do that. Just wear wool socks if you're gonna decide to wear socks at all. But I wear these at night. I actually wear these sandals when I go out backpacking. The, if your pack is not too heavy, you don't need to wear boots. And I would actually recommend you wear running shoes or sandals when you go out. Um, I've done almost all of my backpacking in sandals and I've always, I've never had blister issues and it keeps your feet dry. But most of my friends, most of the backpackers I see are using what's called trail running shoes and that's the most popular shoe right now on the trail. Uh, the other clothing I often bring with me is what's called a balaclava, which is a uh, face mask. These are pretty cheap, you can get this for like $20 on Amazon. But you can just bring any wool hat, it doesn't have to be this specific. These are long johns, these are just thermal underwear. I got these at Sport Mart on sale for like 20 bucks. You could just bring any pants or any sort of thermal underwear. To, if you're gonna be wearing shorts throughout the day, you want something to cover your legs at night. But, but these are not essential, essential items. You can always go into your sleeping bag and you don't need to bring as much clothing, and especially during the summer months. So these are, I would say, shoulder season, which is spring and fall items. And I also brought a, a down parka, which is a Uniqlo down parka. I, I uh, highly recommend what's called an ultralight down. It unfolds into, a, into an actual jacket that weighs less than a t-shirt. And this is about $70 at Uniqlo. And it goes into this nice little pod here. So that's the, that's the sleep system. And you can just hang around camp in this clothes. This is, a, this is what uh, is basically all you need to go on a backpacking trip with. I would don't necessarily need, think you need extra underwear or extra t-shirts. You're gonna only, you should only change your clothes about once, even in a week. So you should be fine with this amount of clothes. So we've already covered